What's up, everybody? Good morning and happy. Th today is actually, is today's Thanksgiving, Lori? Today is Thanksgiving Day. It is, isn't it awesome? And we are at our uh, new uh, paradise. Here's Kitty with us this morning. Hi, she's with us in the video. Um, we're staying at Yellow Jacket Campground up in the Swanee River area. And uh, we love it. Um, we are doing a preemptive uh away mission to find out if our travel trailer the Galileo 3 is going to be a good fit here and from what we've been seeing and looking at it's going to be fantastic so uh what do you think Lori? I think it's perfect yeah, yeah I can't wait you notice that I have shaved this morning I know you've seen our other videos and I look like a mountain man but that just ain't really me you know so I'm back to being bald and beautiful so you know all that being said uh, Kitty's really enjoying us this is a very friendly campground I'm going to pan around a little bit. You can see there'll be some uh, RVs behind us trying to find them. There they are, parking up right at the edge of the beautiful Swanee River. Take a look at this. In this beautiful, they have boat ramp here. Um, you can rent pontoon boats and other things. Very awesome place. I uh, love it. There's a little shot of the sign there. And we'll get back around to you here. And, and this, I, this is actually for the park yes. that is next to mm -hmm. um, Yellow Jacket Campground. Which is right. It's this, here. It's I'm a separate pan, park. I'll pan around a little There's bit. Trail walks. A little um, <clears throat> community trail head that you can take through there. There's a just enjoy nature. There's a lot of stuff to do here, and it's fun. Um, they have a swimming pool, a hot tub, a laundry room, a very nice set of outdoor bathrooms if you don't do the bathroom thing. They rent cabins. We're staying in a cabin. We'll show you that in a little bit here. It's the it's the park model, as we've been told. So park model. It's the park model. But they got fire pits in front of all the places. It's a beautiful. But we'll do a little bit more on it, and we'll walk around and show you a little bit this morning on this beautiful Thanksgiving morning. Look at that beautiful sky and all that. And the river behind us. i got to show you this river over here real quick. Look at that one pan around. Let's take a look. Oh, the beautiful Swanee River. <laughs> I love it. That's my theme since we're all up on it. So uh, we'll get back to you in a little bit. Hey, we found another little, uh, I guess, a dock or something that comes out off onto the Swanee River. And it would be perfect to uh, kind of fish off of. We'll go around here. That's the Swanee River behind me. Awesome. Coming down and flows back down through here behind Lori a little bit. It's uh, it's very, very pretty here. So uh, peaceful. That would be the word I would describe the best. So Yellow Jacket, great campground. If you're into the camping scene, um, they've got 50 amp. They got 30 amp. They got uh, regular house in plugs, uh, sewage, um, cabins, cabins uh, all kinds. So I can't talk uh, enough about this place. So. So we're down here uh, on where you can get a little boat uh, docking area here. We went fishing down here a couple days ago. Uh, Laura and I are convinced there are no fish in this lake. There's no fish in this lake. And we've tried. And There's I, alligators. Yeah, I'm going to post a picture of the little alligator that I saw um, yesterday, day before. Anyway, beautiful dock. Um, you can't get a bad view anywhere at the Yellow Jacket campground. I uh, I can't sing its praises more. My parents came and stayed here for a couple years over the last 15 years we've been up to visit. And so now that we're about to embark on the travel trailer adventure and uh, we're gonna come and stay here for a while and hang out, a lot of nice people. I can't, but back on it, everything that you need, you can, uh, you can rent boats. I mentioned that earlier, and there's all types of places. Even if you want to bring your boat, you can dock it here. Um, it's really awesome. It's called a boat slip. It's a boat slip. Boat slip. Yep, boat slip. Thank you. All right. So I was going to give you a little bit of a uh, heads up. If you guys aren't into camping, uh, they do offer these, uh, they call them uh, cabins. This is the park model we have that we're staying at, and you'll see some pictures of us posting about it um <clears throat> has a fire pit um i'll start around so you can see a little bit we've kind of brought some little decorations with us to show you around here um i picked more hit these little ceramic christmas guys we get around over here sorry for that but we brought our inflatable turkey with us um this is uh, a gobbles gobbles 
And you see the little snowman back there, and there's a Santa Claus right there. But this is great. Um, runs about, gosh, it depends on how long you stay, but it's very reasonable. We've got a great parking. The Enterprise is parked right back behind us. But I'm going to pan around a little bit. Um, we're in the middle of the park, the backside. Um, very friendly people here. Haven't run into a stranger. Had people come up and sit at the campfire with us last night and introduce themselves. Um, behind me, if I can get around to it, there's a path that's right there. Um, you can see it in the background. Down to a dog walk, and you walk down through there. It's um, a lot of cypress knots and knees coming up out of the ground. It's a nice, uh, well-maintained path, lighting at night, and there's a dog walk and a small pond back there. So. They actually have an area where you can let your dog run free a little bit, you know. I wouldn't do it with Kitty because uh, she's got too much cling on her, if you know what I mean. So there's where we're staying. So I want to come up on the steps of our cabin. Nice little set of stairs. Got Kitty's stroller down there. All our fishing stuff. We have our coolers. Um, I want to pan around a little bit. There's our little fire pit area that I was just at. And see that blue bucket? I, I took a picture of it, but you can actually buy a bucket of firewood, and that thing is overflowing. We used a lot last night. Usually, it was the wood was sticking out of the top. They bring it up on a little tractor for you, and depending on how much you stay out by the fire pit, it, it's good for two, three days. Um, I think it's around twenty eight, twenty nine dollars for that. Um, our neighbors are having Thanksgiving. They have relatives and stuff coming in, but beautiful. A lot of a lot of space. I'm gonna take you inside a little bit. This is the porch area. Um, come out here and I smoke my cigar. Lori smokes her, her cigarette as we come up through here. Look around. I got a really nice sliding glass door. You come in here. Now we've been living here for four days now. So, Kitty, she's extremely comfortable. Are you comfortable, Kitty? Are you having a good time on vacation? You are. Okay. So look around a little bit. Very dog friendly park. Um, here's a little kitchen and a little kitchenette here. I wish you guys could smell this because. Lori's cooking Thanksgiving. Let's go see if we can get a picture. But I'm peeking there. there. Oh, yeah, there's the turkey cooking right there. Oh, snap. Some peas going on. Lori's going to make her world-famous deviled eggs. A lot of cabinets. A lot of uh, awesome cabinet space and everything. And you pan around, we brought to our inside turkey. Um, this is Gobble's cousin, Turkey Lurkey. Um, of course, as always, uh, bring alcohol. My cigars are there. This is our my our whole little setup here. Always have alcohol. Now, the drive out to where you can get supplies and stuff is maybe 15, 20 minute. But there's a full grocery store, liquor store, bait and tackle if you're into fishing and all that. I'm going to walk through here. It's a central heat and air in here. Nice. It's been keeping us cool and hot at the same time. Bathroom, I'll scan around. Pretty good size of bathroom. Uh, nice walk-in uh, shower. Lori's going ahead of me to clean up because she's worried, well, we're going to be on the internet and people are going to see stuff. I'm like, hey, people live. Nice it's bed. Bathroom. It's a queen size. A lot of amenities. We always bring... A lot of storage. A lot of storage. Too. Always bring an extra little plug-in for your phones and stuff like that. And uh, Look at this. a lot of fun. A lot of storage. A lot of storage. This whole thing opened up the big closet there. Oh, there's my big fat butt on the in the mirror. A lot of storage. Yep. Mm -hmm. The only thing that they ask is that you bring your own linens. Yep. Yeah, gotta bring your own linens. And there, there's a place for TV. So if, if you, you bring a bring TV, you screen. know, they don't have one in here. They have, they offer the one in the living room. Nice refrigerator, a lot of storage. Uh, again, um, if you need to buy ice, uh, they have a few ice trays in there. The ice machine is not hooked up on this thing. They offer ice at the office. I think it's three dollars, three dollars and fifty cent a bag. Same place where you can get firewood. So you're not really roughing it, but you are. You know, we got the uh, Thanksgiving Day parade going on there, and uh, and there you have it. That's the inside of uh, our little cabin in the middle of the woods. Everybody, hey, you know the bad thing about this video is we forgot to do a closing uh, video sequence for the yellow jacket. So we got home. And decided we'll just throw something together real quick. But go check out Yellow Jacket Campground. It's uh, near Old Town in the Swanee River area. Um, it's awesome. Let me get these glasses on my house. I look like Mickey Mouse or something. Um, they have a swimming pool, a hot tub, all types of amenities. Ice is available. You can firewood. Rent boats, you can too. rent a boat, fish right off the dock. You've seen the videos. Check it out. It's Yellow Jacket. They have a Facebook page and a uh, website. Um, 
We're going to go back up in July and hang out with the travel trailer, which we traveled without it in this video and a couple others. But we got home and realized that our really good friend Thomas had um, galvanized, as we call it, our travel trailer, the Galileo 3. We want to give you a little sneak pre preview. This is the uh, over the our bed and our travel trailer. We have a view screen, and the of course, the Enterprise is coming up to us. And there's She's our bed. Kitty, kitty back is back there. Kitty. Hey, Kitty. What's up, baby? So anyway... We'll give you more later. That's just a sneak preview, just a little one. So we want to ask you, uh, please uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel and share it with as many people as you can. And enjoy. This is about fun. We are not professional YouTubers. We may be one day, but, you know, hey, you're learning every day of things to do. And my good friend and producer of these videos, uh, Randy, um, helps me out a lot with them. So go check out Yellow Jacket Facebook page. They have a website. Check it out. A lot of fun campfire. You don't have to have a camper to go there. They have um, what are they uh, cabins, and you can go fishing. It is and to get away from everywhere. Everything. Just remember, no cell phone service there, so you it's really get awesome. to get. It's really awesome. So. It's awesome. But we'll see you next time on travel trailer trekkies. Subscribe. Love you. Bye.